Here's a stepwise process to help you learn how to do multiphonics on trombone. Please make sure that you're comfortable with each step before moving on to the next step. Step one, learn how to sing through your trombone. Now, this may seem simplistic, but you need to make sure that you're forcing the sound through the tubing and you're not letting it escape in between the rim of the mouthpiece and your lips. So this is the right way to do it. If you do it right, sometimes you'll hear the notes kind of break because of the natural acoustics of the instrument. It's nothing to worry about and I wouldn't spend too much time trying to smooth that out because when you add the playing to the singing, that'll smooth it out for you. Here's the wrong way to do it. See, that sounds just coming right out from in between the rim and my lips. That's not gonna help you. The hard part is actually forcing that sound through the trombone. Well, that's what it feels like to do multiphonics. You really have to be able to do that. Remember, spend as long as you need to on step one, that's just singing through your trombone until you're really comfortable doing it because that's super important. If you're not able to do that, your multiphonics won't be successful. It's not even important to move your slide. You just heard me sing Ode to Joy and I just stayed in first position. You can do it that way or you can move your slide along with your voice. Either way is fine at this point. The next step is to go back and forth between singing and playing. I recommend playing pretty soft and singing pretty loud so you can get used to that balance. When you put those two together, you'll get the right sound. Don't use your tongue to do this exercise. Go back and forth very smoothly. Again, no tongue. And the sensation here is that when you shift from playing to singing, it just feels like you're going to disengage your lips a little bit and then back and forth. There should really be very little difference in your chops between the played and the sung notes. Once you're able to go back and forth, Play, sing, play, sing. It's time to overlap those just a little bit. This might be the hardest step for you, so spend plenty of time learning how to do this. You're going to start by playing a very soft note and then add your voice to that very same pitch. And then you're going to drop the trombone out. Next, it's time to sing a little bit of harmony. In my experience, perfect fifth is an easy interval to get started with. So we're going to play an F and sing a C. First, get these pitches in your head by playing the notes individually. It might even help just to learn how that C feels when you sing it and your slide is in first position. <laughs> so you're actually going to really make your voice loud and your trombone soft. Of course, there are a lot more details that you can get into with multiphonics, but hopefully this short tutorial will give you an idea of how to get started. Once you learn the basics, you can do cool stuff like this.